Well, this week, a tradition 90 years in the making will put the spotlight on some remarkable kids from right here in Northeast Ohio. Five local spellers will be competing in the Scripps National Spelling Bee in the nation's capital. News 5's Catherine Ross introduces us to one speller from Doylestown. Conversations at the Yeager household Manumet. lately sound oh like boy. this. M A N U M I T. 14 year old Andrew Yeager has been putting in the practice. T A N D O O R I. With his coach and father, Derek Yeager. Naivete. N A I V E T E. Around two to hours. A day, something like that. I could probably work with him all day, every day, but that would probably drive him nuts. In many ways, Andrew is your typical teen. I play baseball, play video games, um, <laughs> talk with friends while playing video games. But he has a certain knack for another kind of competition. I've always won the uh, school bee, except for the first year I did in fifth grade, which my brother beat me. The younger kids taking after their parents. Mom won around way back when. I, I won around when I was in, in eighth grade and uh, just kind of carrying on the, the tradition. This week, Andrew is taking the tradition to the next level at the Scripps National Spelling Bee in Washington, D.C. To know we finally get to go to D.C. is sort of a kind of a payoff reward for for all the, the effort he's put into everything. It's Andrew's second time in the national competition. During last year's virtual beat, he tied for 111th place. I would hopefully like to get past like how far I got last year. Yeager's father says no matter the outcome, the lessons outside of spelling P-H-Y-C-O-L-O-G-Y have been invaluable. Yes, it just shows that if you put some effort behind something, you can really accomplish a whole lot of things. S-U-C-C-U-M-B. In Doylestown, Catherine Ross, News 5.